previously on the Kosharskis. Game pros. Aaron is climbing up a ladder. Dude, he's like an old man. Luby's time. Did you get my message? The Holiday Inn Express. We're, we're in the workout room. I'm doing a live stream right now. And me and Josh, we're going to Dave and Buster's. Mario Kart. My mother is playing real life Mario Kart. But I think we were just invited to the Game Chasers hotel room. Uh -oh. We stopped by a mall over here in Houston. What? This can't. This can't possibly be it, Josh. Or NRG Stadium. I talk about we're swimming. We're out in the hot tub and swimming pool. My window won't roll up. We might be stuck in Texas forever, Josh. Look, everybody. The light thing is like bobbing around in front of Joshy. We're here, we're waiting to find out if our car will be fixed in time or if we will have to stay another day in Texas. So stay tuned. What would you have done if we didn't come back? Because we had a flat tire. What if we would have just stayed in Texas? <laughs> Went to work, cleaned my house. You would have been upset. It was out of your control. You know, if you'd have stayed there by yourself, or not by yourself, but just, you know, stayed there on your own devices, I'd probably still said, okay, bye. So, we're here waiting. Mama Che is eating a banana. <laughs> yeah, because he won't go to the car and get my food because I'm crashing over here. And the great Texas spirit over here, as we're in trouble ourselves, it says, it's okay to say no to panhandlers. Meaningful change, not spare change. Oh wait, and next to it, it says suck black dick. No, it's not. It does not say that. Were you upset over the flat tire? Nope. Why did you upset? We had a guy patch up our toe. And now, Mama K is a little upset right now because she doesn't want to have to uh, go here. But we're at NTB Tire. This is essentially Tire Kingdom for this area. And uh, we're going to hopefully have them fix my tire that has like two or three nails in it. Woo! Um, did you think the flat tire was going to keep us in Texas forever? No, I knew it wouldn't keep us forever. But it was a fiasco. Oh, and to talk about the flat tire, we went to this place. Uh, what's the name of it, Aaron? NTV. NTV. It's it's a, f a sister company of of um, Tire Kingdom over here. So they're affiliated in, as the same company. So they honored Aaron's warranty. So he got the tire prorated and a little cheaper. So when they were done, they parked the car. Well, I get out of the store where the tire place was to walk to the car, and I go all the way over to his car. I open the door, and I just about died. I thought somebody stole all his video games. Lo and behold, there was another car that looked exactly like Aaron's, the exact same color, and I thought it was his, but it wasn't. They patched up the car, right? And on the way out, I go over there, and I'm like, holy I crap. I into the same car. I opened up the door, and I was ready to scream bloody oh, murder thinking somebody stole all our stuff. Long tire. Is that what it's called? Ling Long. Ling Long. But yeah, yeah, I thought, I thought, I thought she moved all my stuff out. I was like, what? Take that but yes, in case you're all wondering, Ling Long is our new tire. Waha! Look at dude, look at this, these arches. Those aren't the arches my mother's used to. She's used to them golden babies. Woo! Golden babies. Golden arches, McDonald's. Look at that. It's an Ethan Allen. Okay, I started. Look guys. Apparently we're going underground to park. 
We're gonna have to do a shoot ton of walking. Oh man, I hope we're gonna be able to find where we gotta go. Now where do we go? That's the right. Turn left. Are we gonna turn left? It says right turn only. Are we gonna make the clearance? No. Man, it's so tight in here. That's what she said. <laughs> Holy f it's so scary. It is literally tight in this mofo. I see. Is that a parking space right up there? I'm so scared right now that it's going to collapse on us. Which way, Josh? Go right. Go right. Go right. There, there's a parking space right there. That's a parking space. No, there's one right here. And there's a parking space right there. all reserved. Reserved. This is reserved here. Yeah, we might So? What do you mean, so? Are you paying the tow bill? Can we go to the right? I think we have to go back down. No. Yeah, we gotta go further down. Yeah, that's all we're doing. That's all ballet parking. We can't go left. Because we should have saw how much ballet parking was. I mean, you can see it's anything over here, but... This sh Why don't they make these things higher? No, you can't go down that way. It's going the one direction. What about this one? Try. Yeah. Go down here. Oh, there we go. Go, 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 go get it. Go get it. Go get it. Oh. Oh, go. We're not going to be able to fit in there. Is that reserved? No. Do you want to get out now before I pull in? <sighs> wow. And I thought I had a dirty car. Look at that. It's got drawings all over it and everything. That is one dirty car, Josh. At least mine's somewhat clean. Yeah. Earlier on this trip, Mama Kay was wondering where the payphone was. Well, there's the payphone, Mother. That's For customer payphone. assistance, use blue light telephone. As a customer assistance, use blue light telephone. Oh, your, For your phone's going assisters. off. <laughs> yeah, I need a wheelchair. What was your opinion of the Galleria Mall in Houston? Four, no, that, that, that place at the mall, the mall itself is four stories. The actual building was what? How many? 12 stories higher or something yeah. like that? 12 stories high. It was awesome. I mean, it was an, a weird mall. You had to go underground to the parking garage and then go up the mall thing, and it was weird. And. Neiman Marcus? What's Neiman Marcus? You don't want to know. Neiman Marcus. Is this expensive? Is, where are we? They got five thousand dollars shirts. What? God, th this is definitely not the place for the Lotto King. How much are these? How much are they? Seventy percent. I want off. these. Wait, what? I want these. Did that just say a thousand dollars for a pair of pants? Dude, I want these. How much are they? They're seventy-five percent off. That's a thousand dollars. <laughs> wow, 300 bucks. How was the Galleria Mall? And can you afford Neiman Marcus? Mm, it's expensive. You can't afford that. Why we even went there? The only thing you could afford was GameStop, and you barely afford that here. Don't record any of Wait, they actually have Ferragamos? That's like everything in your collection, Ferragamos. We need to go to the GL floor. Look at this. Yeah, this is a marble waterfall. A marble water. What? Where are we? This is too expensive for you, Lottery King. Come on. Okay, with all this money, this elevator. Hold on, I gotta check one thing. Where's the? Oh wait, it doesn't have it. Doesn't have it. Yeah. Well, your elevator is garbage. Hey, Louis Vuitton. I want to go check out the Gucci. And they actually have Ferragamos. Is it? What did you think of the Texas-sized mall? Didn't go. Didn't see it. They got Chanel. Yeah, go right Gucci. Hey, how much are these? Hey, you had Fucci at one point. Those are nice. What's it? What's it? Nine ninety-five. Those are nice. A thousand dollars. That's yeah. Seven. Josh, you're not in Kansas anymore, so I don't think we should uh yet know. 
Josh, I have a bad feeling all these are way too expensive for you. What is this? The Wall Street Journal? That looks like the Monopoly man. He counting his monies. The Oriental Rug Bazaar. What? Bazaar. Yeah, yeah, there's gonna be a Trump store in here for sure. You think we can afford to eat there? White Oak Kitchen plus drinks? What do you think? Look at that, we got Pac Sun, we got, uh, oh, Cheesecake Factory, Josh. This is a giant mall in Houston. Well, look, Josh, there's an ice skating rink down there. That's cool. So the, the, the Galleria Mall, the, the Houston Galleria Mall, this 9, 10, 11, 12, however many story building where the top seven or eight stories were a hotel and the bottom four stories was literally all mall. I've never seen a mall that was that was more than two stories. Normally you got a bottom story and maybe a second story. There was like three to four stories of mall. And it was it was nuts. Uh oh. Uh oh. Josh, you found the Brett Wings and the Mito. And, the, and, and all these, the Raymond Wheel, the Nevado, that, that's all Josh. So, Josh, what brings you over here? <laughs> was it the Brett or the Ling? It was a nice watch. All the tattoo watches. It's cool. Josh! Toy Story Land! It's a Disney store! Look at that. That is awesome. Mama K, why are you relaxing and watching the kids' movies? You're the little kitty farm here at the Disney store. Why? I'm here because my back is killing me. Aww. I'm looking for my Disney card I have. Um, what movie were you watching in the kids' section of the Disney store? What movie? I wasn't watching a movie. There was a movie playing. There was a movie playing, but I... That I don't know. Okay, um... I wasn't watching a movie in the store. I went in the store to have the guy check my card that I had to see if it was a gift card, but it wasn't. It was my actual Disney pass that I had. Josh, why are we in the Disney store of all places? I don't know, but I still have a gift card, so... No, your mother found her gift card. Oh, she better not stole my gift card. What? You still have... Josh is enticed by the plush sale. Buy one, get one for $2. But the one that you buy is freaking $19. So you're literally paying 20 for two. Two for 20 deal he's here at the Disney Wally store. Wait, oh, Wally? how much is Peter Pan? I'm Blu-ray. Hold on, Wally is $9.95. Hell yeah. He's on sale. He's like, he's like a miniature Rob the Robot. Josh, check it out. The Lucky Brand here at the Houston Mall. What? That's cool. Demo it looks like Josh is about to buy a ex very expensive hat for $2. Somehow it's $5, but it's 50% off, so it makes it 2 3709 I hate you. Josh likes Lucky Brand. Josh wants Lucky Brand. Josh is staying in motherfucking Lucky Brand. I'm going to go to the bathroom, and then I'm going to go to the Mac store. But I guess Josh is staying here in Lucky Brand land. I, I'll see him when he gets done buying all his Ferragamos. What? This is like a 12-story mall or something. What? Yeah, I'm, look at, the I'm looking at GameStop from the elevator. Finally, something cheap we recognize at GameStop. Holy... Yeah. It's 4 for 20 back on. Yeah. So Josh, what'd you just buy? What'd you just buy at GameStop? Josh just bought, uh, sh sh show us, Mega Man cereal and the guy, the, inside, the guy inside, the guy inside, Funko Pop, Pat. the guy inside was like, you saved a lot of money with your card because it's over the amount of time you save money with your card. I've seen people save a, maybe a hundred bucks or so and he looked at the receipt <laughs> and he's like, what the f Cause look at this, look at this. Look at my, look at my lifetime. I've saved almost $4,000 lifetime. What? 
right, this is the greatest the store. You, you can't film in there. Why? Why not? This is the greatest store ever invented. Apple. That is that baby. What's better, Apple or Windows? You know the answer to that. Windows. What? Windows. Of course, Apple's of garbage. It's Apple. Apple is overpriced garbage that once you break, they just you just hit to pay one double. trillion net worth. Oh. No one cares. So, right there is the Apple store. And not even two stores down is Microsoft. Boo! Boo! We don't, we don't want Windows, Josh. Screw you. Houston is inspired. So, Josh was trying to tell me to buy a Microsoft computer, but when we went into the Microsoft store, there was like five people in there, and four of them were employees. But in the Mac store, the Mac store is packed. Once you go Mac, you never go back. So in recap, win Windows store, nobody. Mac store, everybody. Josh gets nobody. Aquarium in the aquarium. Be their last sighting declining fandom among Brony. Oh, whoa, that's not good. Sorry, Jabroni. I hope they have another Brony convention. Cuba! Houston Trunk Factory. Did you just say that was a Brentling? Listen. What? I want to get a wheelchair. Can you push me in it? Huh. It's one You'll be pushing me in it. My legs are killing me. My back is killing me. Oh. I'm a lot older than you. Okay, fine. We'll push you. Oh. Mont Blanc. That's a cool store. Probably expensive, too. And there she blows. The king of watches. The Rolex. Don't even bother, Joshy. Don't even bother. It's on this floor. It's on Look at this, there's a downstairs, there's a middle stairs, there's an upstairs, there's a hotel. What? Oh no! It's down. Yes, Mother, going down. read the sign. I see that where's the escalator elevator. It's right here. The elevator's right It's there. right here. The escalator's, oh wait, I see the escalator going down, it's right here. Come here. You guys missed it. Mama K just got yelled at by a security guard for screaming and yelling. That's what you get. Stop screaming in the mall. Look at this. We got we got China Max. We got Ichiban Pizzeria. There's a McDonald's. I think I'm going to McDonald's. I got the coupons. I got the apps. And and there's a Chili's. There's a Chili's in the food court, mother. Fine. This food court is so big. There's a Chili's in the middle of the food court. This is the this is the biggest. This is Sabaro. Josh, this is the biggest food court I've ever seen in my life, and there's a Chili's in the food court. Okay. XD Ride, Zombies, Gigamon, Robot Riot, and Les Fantitos. Wow. We settled on, we're eating at Sabaro's, and of course, first at the buffet, it's the Fat Boy Junior. We, we ate at Sabaro's that had an actual, an actual buffet bar. These kids, I don't know what it is with them and their buffet bars. Everywhere we go, we go to a buffet bar. It's all you can eat. Josh is spending money like he has money to spend. I, I got water. money to spend. Can you imagine this, people? I got money to spend. You don't. Get this kid comes with us to Retropalooza with no money. Manages to buy all kinds of stuff, literally, and makes all kinds of money. How does he do it? I don't know. It's not your business. But he's hoarding money. Both of my boys are hoarding it's money. Magic. It's called theft. Mm-hmm. I'm in the H and M, but the whips off the chain. What's the H and M? They doing the flag Go! Look, that's where we were at in there. That ride was scary. Uh, I don't know who won. Josh says he won. I could have won. I don't know, but we're gonna go back and get Mama K. We need to get out of this mall, Josh. We're spending way too much time and way too much money in an expensive mall that we can't afford. Goodness gracious, great malls of fire. 
Look at all these food places in this mall. This is one of the biggest food courts I think I've ever seen. I believe that there's a Chili's. There's a Chili's, Josh. Since when has there ever been a Chili's in a mall? Ain't nothing in this mall. Not to alarm anybody, but we've lost Mama K. Yeah, we've lost Mama K. It was nuts, it was nuts, it was nuts. Another thing I want to point out is um, my mother claiming that she's not able to walk, needs a cane to go everywhere, but then when we went looking for her, she's just running, running along and she beats us back to the other side of the mall. Me and Josh have been looking up and down for Mama K. She's on the loose, we can't find her. Oh look, another watch store that Josh can't afford. Oh look, more watches. Answer, answer. Oh, it's Fanny. Answer, answer, 713. Waldo, where have you been? We spent like 20 minutes looking for you. Mother, mother, how did you get away from us? You won't walk two feet, but we turned around, we went down looking for you, and you were somehow gone. They said there's an elevator here somewhere. How did you beat me and Josh from one side of the mall to the other side of the mall when you have a cane? Yeah. Well, you see, I had a lot of pain that day, and I wasn't really walking too good, so I used the cane. But then I held it most of the time, because that's what they all... It, you'll see that I held it more than I used it. So, but anyhow, I went looking for them, and I couldn't find them. So I ended up running ahead of them somehow because after sitting for a few minutes eating, it helped my pain go away. So I was able to walk a little faster. I went oh, up the escalator or the elevator, got to the top floor looking for them, and they come after me and I beat them there and they want to know why. Because I got my second wind after eating, I guess. I made an Easter egg for Josh and put it on the roof. Surprise, Josh. We are leaving the, out, the art gallery mall of Houston, downtown uh, Houston. Um, I'm backing up. I gotta get Mama Kay in this car. And we will see you guys later for another mall adventure. Look at this building way over there, man. Make it right here. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Oh, God. And then Michelle's going to be down there. I wanted to take okay, a picture. Okay, we need to send. take a vote on this. Now, we were just in this mall here. Not in that place. Four stories high mall, if not more. Which way, Josh? There's the Neiman Marcus the that we were in. It's on the right. Okay, yeah. and look Can at I this tall there? building yeah. way up there, man. Let's go straight. And Aaron, Aaron, there's a Sheridan over there. Aaron would not go to one of the tallest buildings and let me see out the city because I wanted to take a picture of this real nice looking cool city. Unfortunately, Aaron didn't think it was cool enough to go see it. Of course it's cool enough. Are you done acting like a baby? So we can go home. I've had enough of Texas. That was all the issue. The reason why the lady came up to you and yelled at you is because you were screaming. If you were acting like a normal human being, that would not have happened. And if and you were acting like a normal human well. being and walked next to me He's like so an adult does supposed to do <laughs> No, 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 no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let her have it, even on the camera. I don't give a crap anymore. I'm done with this. I, this is the last hotel I'm paying for. What the fuck did So you better hope we get home. So, now she's gonna walk like that. <laughs> okay, so the problem we're having, it's not even a problem. It's, 
it's more or less, it's more or less, we're staying an extra night in Texas because we had a, an issue with the tire. Oh, fudge. We had an issue with the tire and it's making us stay an extra night. All I was saying is I'm paying for tonight's hotel and then after that we, we have to get home after this because I don't really want to pay for another night because we're on a budget and we have to budget the money and because of the tire this morning, that was an extra $100 I wasn't planning on spending. So, this is it. I pay for this hotel, and then we go straight home tomorrow. And that's all I was saying. And she blew up on me. She started screaming. Uh, Josh got some footage. Watch Exposed. Uh, hopefully if it comes out. Anyway, yeah, so that's what happened. That's the rundown. So we're staying one more night in Texas. Cockleberry Farms! We're on the second story. We stopped at another hotel. This is a, hopefully the last hotel of the trip. Unfortunately, it is still in Texas. Huh? But yeah, look at that. It smells like smoke, but This is almost bit, look, hold on, how is this a better, how does this have a better room and a better TV? And it's cheaper than the What? How was the second Houston hotel, the one we had to get on that last extra day that we weren't planning oh, on Oh, the PMS? bed was uncomfortable. It wasn't as comfortable as the first bed at the first uh, up during the hotel stay when we were there. But if you all want a nice, comfortable bed, you gotta get a sleep number. My friend has one. And he put a nice, plush, queen-size, mattress cover over it and it has the up and down motion on it and boy does it feel comfy if our mother sees you with that coke you're dead where, where is she we need to go hopefully this was our last hotel i got 12 to 14 hours of driving to do today i'm um, gonna get as much done today as possible and then tomorrow we're going to head back to good old St. Petersburg, Florida. What is it? It says Cons Home and Plus. Appliance Superstore. It's too late now, so you got to wait. Put it back. If you go up and get in the clear, the entire city's right there. Look at that. There it is. Look guys, that is Texas City. Boy, I wish you would have let me go up on the highest building. Does it say be someone? Hashtag no SB4. Be something. Oh, well, anyhow. Woo! Look at, oh, oh, look at this. Get that. Mount Rushmore. Get it. Get it. Get it. Mount Rushmore, guys. I hope you got that. I sure did. Oh, thank God. Now there's a city. You're going too fast, but I got whatever I can. Look at that, man. Ah. Goodbye, Houston. Goodbye, Houston. Goodbye, Houston. There you go. There you go. Houston. What is your opinion of Houston City? Like when you saw the lights, the towers, and the buildings? It's way better than this place. Look at the sign, everybody. It's Polar Pop. We oh didn't man, even get a Polar Pop, Pop, Pop. We didn't even get a single Polar Pop here. Ah. Well, you missed everything, but uh, this is what's left of it. We have just hit Louisiana, baby. We are in the dirty south. The Louisiana Bayou. Woo! Oh, and mom can't sleep in there. Yeah, there's a sign. There's an official sign. The welcome to Louisiana sign. smarter which of these is not a tool used by painters chisel canvas brush oh, paint brush and canvas chisel yeah coming for you boy 
100,000 points. Get bonus bonus right, you, didn't, you didn't get bonus right. Okay, hold on. Is it my turn? Hold on. On which continent is Greece located? I forget North America. Europe. You can't help him. <laughs> ah. You can't help him. Booyah. Kasha. Player two is the winner. I'm smarter than you. Uh, but we you. already knew that. Yeah. High school dropout versus college. Woo! Two plus seven equals nine. Let's go. Nine oh plus God. what equals nine? Oh my God, come on. Blank plus eight. Oh my God. This is bad. Blank plus 18 equals 43. This is uneasy, by the way, mind you folks. <laughs> what plus 18 is 43? I don't know. Oh no, she doesn't know. How do you not know that? Let's see, she knows it, let's see. Oh, you missed, she missed it. The answer was 25, by the way. Running out of time. What plus 36 equals 79? Nope. What plus 40 69? Time is up. Well, let's see. Correct answers. So on very easy basic math questions, you got four out of six correct, mother. Which is good enough for like a 60 to 70 percent maybe? Uh-oh. What is this? Select Next which one's is. heavier, the rat or the grape? There you go. Which is great. Good job. Which one's heavier? She's blowing through this one somehow. She lost that. Looks like she's blowing through. Oh wow, this is the same. Woohoo! Okay, I'm done with this. Hold on. Oh, hold on. I gotta see if she gets a perfect score here. Because she's gotten every answer correct so far somehow. Six. Five. Oh, she got the last one wrong. Her one second. How was... What? Time is up. Let's see what she scored. 46,000. You got 10 out of 11. So on that one, you did, you did pretty good. Continue. Okay, cool. Ooh. So on the way back, Mama Kay and Josh went to McDonald's and they played a trivia game. And uh, we, we all did a trivia game and we competed and I think I won. Uh, but the, the most disturbing thing was Mama Kay missing some questions on the basic math. That was a little disturbing. But uh, but yeah, we did a McDonald's trivia game, and I won. Okay, now now we're testing Mama K memory. Here, type another one. Oh, you gotta tap the buttons that it says to tap. Nope, you missed one. Now, now can she do it in the exact order? She got one. Then she got two. It's the same ones over and over again. Oh, let's see. This one's a little bit more tricky. I actually got that one. Oh, come on. Can't she do it? Oh, this one's... She did it! What? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Time is up. Time up. Correct answer is seven. Incorrect answer is two. Let's see what her final score is for the all three rounds. Top gear, 20,000, 45,000, 42,000. Throw for a score, 108,000. Did she get the bonus round? Will Mama Kay get bonus round? Is she smart for bonus round? Survey says third place. Waha. Josh, you trying to be his mother. Okay, incorrect, incorrect, one. incorrect. 76 minus 54 is what? Why are you doing it? Oh, I'm just doing it all wrong. 29 plus what is 32? It's three, you dumb dumb. I know, I hit the wrong button. Blank star four is 82. That's just two. 16 minus 15, 45. I know that. 
I have to help him. He does, he's been getting all these wrong. Mama K is better at math. Yeah, no, so no, 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 you lose. School. You lose. I gotta do it. No, I don't call anyone. Okay, well, he's trying again. I'll give you the final update when he's done playing. Wait, it didn't hit me. I didn't hit it right. You don't have to hit the mouse, you just get it. I know what I gotta hit. Josh doing good at this. Six, five, four, three. Oh, how did he do that? How did he do that? That was sick. What? 10 plus 7 equals 5 plus 8 equals 9 minus 5. I was meant before. You, no. 6 minus what? <laughs> You're not hitting the wrong button, Josh. You don't know these numbers. You know the numbers. Mama K and Josh, basic math. Fuck you. I just have to know. Let's see. Let's see if we can get this one. Ooh, there we go. Two. Oh, Josh ain't gonna get this one. Come on, hurry up. Five, four, and last one. And she fucked that one. Oh, you lose. How many? You're right. How many get right? Oh, miss five. Mama K is better at basic math than you, Josh. That's oh, same basic. This proves basic math. Same basic, Dumbo. Yeah, yeah, you basic, and you're gonna lose this one because oh, he lost that one. You got this. This is the lower one. She hit the wrong button. I'm done. <laughs> Mama K is smarter than a fifth grader. Well, she's not. And you're a fifth grader. So that stupid machine costed us an hour worth of driving time as we're still in Louisiana trying to get back. Um, this might be a oh, million part shit. episode. Aaron? What? I didn't even finish scratching this off.